What's going on you guys? It is your boy Chris Status and welcome back to Near Automata. Oh my god. Like I said, we always gotta open up that way. Always. Each time. It never fails. Cause we gotta we gotta always embrace we're embracing the gloriousness of this booty. We we got no choice. So last time we were here, we discovered the existence of the aliens. Yeah? So that that's a thing. Okay, I have all these that I can travel to. Okay, sick. Uh, let's head back to the bunker, because I think they might need us for stuff. Stuff and things. Um, but yes, we discovered the existence of aliens. Yes, there are aliens in this game, and we met them. At least what was left of them. They're, they're all dead. Um, apparently the androids revolted against their creators, as most robot cliches would. And now we have to deal with this crap. Also, I'm moving. Um, if you guys listen to the disclaimer that at the start of the oh. report on the events surrounding the alien wreckage. I'm sorry, I'm then talking to this whole time. I'm talking the to my audience. Humanity needs time to shut up. God, I'm talking to people here. Jesus Christ. Anyways, as you all may know, at the disclaimer at the start of the video, at least I hope Mavis put it there. I'm moving. So I've been making a crap ton of videos and everything else. Um, like I said, like it said in the disclaimer, Discord, every other link is going to be down in the description below so that you all can kind of, you know, find that stuff and keep up to date with me and all of the progress and stuff that's going on there. So yeah, anyways, now you can talk. Until then, this information must be kept confidential. Why? Speak of it to no one. Why? Of course. Okay. Your next mission is to gather additional intel on the individual known as Pascal. You mean that freaky machine we ran into? This order comes directly from the Council. What the fuck? Knowledge of such unique individuals is essential for the success of future missions. Understood. Alright then, uh, I guess we gotta- I guess we gotta go back and visit them now. Oh my god. No! Don't do that here! I'm gonna end the game prematurely. Not doing that again. Wee! Alright. Man, the commander sure is a slave driver, huh? And now we have to go back to the city ruins. Well, first things first is a rest a little bit to be it's been a while I'll rest if I feel like it yeah and I feel like you need to I mean, yes you need to yes rest you want to save yes Do you want to continue the game yes all right there we go took a small nap and literally 9s watched me the entire time and we're not gonna question that either Okay, now, I need recovery, because I'm out of the small stuff. I have enough for that, so I mean, mine is freaking well. Alright. Okay, now we gotta go and speak to that one chick. That one, that one trash woman. Well, not trash woman, but freaking... You know what the freak I mean. Uh, desert camp, center, housing... Park Ruins, Pascal's Village. I love that we can just do this now. So, so are like the android bodies stored in those machines or are they dematerialized only to be rematerialized wherever they need to be? Or am I, am I not understanding that correctly? I don't know. I don't know if I'm actually understanding that properly or not. But regardless though, that's a, that's a, that's a fond, fond question for for you know a video or things of that nature you know um if you made it this far in the series awesome you must love it you must love my commentary i appreciate it why don't you why don't you drop a like and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you're really really interested <laughs> okay shameless plug aside dang it my skirt came back uh i'll nuke in a safe area i can't nuke here where's pascal at okay she's up there Okay, but I can shoot out here, though. It makes me wonder if I actually can safely nuke out here and not cause any sort of destruction or mayhem. How's it go? Um... Oh, it's 9S and 2B, yes? Yep, that's it. That's my name. Don't worry it out. Those machines cost quite the ruckus, don't you think? Heck yeah. We need to talk. Of course. I'll help however I can. Okay, so... 
Literally already off the bat, there's a question about the freaking aliens and how we're not supposed to be asking about that. And I'm tempted to ask them that, even though I know good well I'm not supposed to be asking that. But... Pacifism. Why do you choose not to fight? We have been alive for hundreds of years. We lost countless friends time and time again. But losing friends isn't what scares me. What scares me is the fact that I've grown used to seeing those I care about die all around me. That's why I decided I've had enough. Aw, well that's nice. Okay, we're avoiding the aliens. Ask about other machines. Yes, Tibby. Aside from this village, are there any other machines that are cut off from the network? I suppose that unpleasant songstress you so kindly defeated in the amusement park wasn't part of the network. You mean that singing thing? Oh, and of course there's the Forest Kingdom, but it... Forest Kingdom? Yes. It's a vast woodland area not far from here. There's a group of machines there attempting to build a nation of sorts. They're quite hostile to outsiders, however. We can't so much as go near the place. Where is it? Northeast of the city ruins. Huh. You should be able to reach it by passing through the ruins of the commercial facility. If you go, however, be careful. Things have been rather rough there lately. This forest kingdom sounds like something we should check out. Yeah, it does sound like something we need to check out. Although I didn't get a chance to ask you about the aliens, so I'm gonna ask you about the aliens even though I know good well I'm not supposed to be asking you about the aliens. Do you know anything about the aliens? Aliens? You mean the ones who created us? I'm sorry, there's not much I can tell you. We've been fighting for centuries without a single message from them. I guess you could say that the fact that they've never given us orders anymore is also the reason why we quit fighting. Okay, that wasn't too bad of information to actually be disclosing. Alright, 9S, let's go. We're gonna... First things first, we need to go back to the resistance camp so we can potentially buy some upgrades and weapons potentially I, I love how 9s just kind of stands outside the machine and waits but then again i don't think that he waits for me to be done transponding all the way over there i think he just runs all the way over there it's just like well she'll be there all right might as well meet her or some crap like that i don't freaking know uh 9s you're so precious dude All right, let's see here. And also, we gotta go meet the, the samurai dude. Okay, that person has a quest. Let's go to the shop person. It's been tough lately, but it's important to get rest. Make sure you keep your weapons in good order too. Well, that's why I'm here, buddy. I can't upgrade any of these. Wow, all right, lovely. Um, well then, uh, can I buy a weapon from you? Nope, alright, great, a a a absolutely, absolutely amazing, alright, cool, we're just gonna, we're just gonna move on though. Alright, well, these are the only upgrades I got, as long as I have to live with, um, we need to head to the forest of God, that's not the sprint button! No. I'd probably scare like half of those villagers. All right, right now we need to head over to the little um, tree village, the tree nation, the f the hit the vi literally we're going to the hidden leaf village. That's that's all it. Oh god, that's right. I forgot that this is here. I forgot that all of this happened in the last episode. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go around it, cause fuck that. Frick! Ah, God! He's level 20s! Jesus Christ, man! Piss off! Do do do! Alright, go that way, and then we gotta keep going this way. Ah, God dang it, bushes. Oh, wait, that's right. I'm still. I got my skirt on. Sorry. The fact that it still manages to hit them impresses me. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, it's coming closer! Oh god, get away! Thank you, Ninus! Clutch Ninus for saving me, bet. GG. Operator 6-0 to 2B. Come in, 2B. 2B here. 
The monitoring signal from the new access point has gone silent. Say to be. Bruh, why we just cut her off like that? Are you willing to call me nines? Nine S works just fine. Well, yeah, but. Uh, Man, oh this job can be pretty rough sometimes, huh? We don't get to choose our assignments, and you should work on keeping your opinions in check. Your ha aren't allowed to be emotional, remember? I think some of us are better at that than others. As we've clearly seen, Tubi is literally the best at containing her emotions, unless a given scenario presents itself that involves her actually needing them. Like when 9S was literally injured, like she she had some sort of emotion in the midst of that. But 9S and Operator 60, all of those people have emotions in a sense. Literally, 60 was crying because she got rejected by her crush. Like, I think it's okay to have some sort of emotion out of this. This must be the commercial structure Pascal was talking about. The records say it was once a facility known as a shopping center. So, so a mall? This, lo this looks very much reminiscent to a mall. More items. I'll take this. No getting through here. Maybe there's some kind of mechanism we could engage? I'm trying to pick up this item, bro. Pick it up. Thank you. Okay, if there's some sort of some sort if of we mechanism. Were human, we probably would have gone shopping and such here, right? More meaningless conjecture. <laughs> You're so serious, 2B. You know that? Honestly, uh multiple machine life forms detected above our position. The forest king. The forest king. Honestly, yeah, that's my question. I want to meet this person. What do you expect? I'm a scanner. Combat was never meant to be my forte. Well, I don't know who this forest king is. He sounds like a classy person. Come on, die already! He's just running away. Yeah, like I couldn't see you. Oh, oh god, okay. It's head moving. Ugh! The fuck is that? Hey, where am I? Oh, it talks! What's that? Hey there, guys. What's up? Uh-uh. This thing's weird, Tubi. Let's kill it. I agree. Wait, what? No. Good idea. No! After it! Oh, God, that thing is a spawn of Satan. Oh, what the? What was that? Whatever it was, I'm not a fan of it, and I need to... What the fuck? Okay, it busted a hole in the wall. Thank God. All right, after it. That thing is creepy. It needs to be Looks exterminated. Like is just ahead. It needs to be purged in flame. <laughs> Good lord. I know there's probably a reference to that, basically because the creator wears a helmet similar to that or some shit like that, but at the moment, I ain't buying it. Not when that thing talked to me like that. Nah. Nah. Not a fan. Not a fan. Forest Zone. It's like a Sonic level. <laughs> Here they come. That the, oh oh king 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 you say you huh? Oh god ah what the I fuck? To be. Oh god it's like a knight on his freaking saddles. You may fight for a king, but I fight for the glory of mankind. These machines. They were talking about a king. Oh right? god, what the freak? <laughs> why is the Oh god, the sword. We should take a look. The sword. Oh god, why is the sword like wedged in my abdomen? Ugh. Get it out. Where's the sword? What? Okay, okay, I think we're good. Okay, there we go. Fixed it. The sword is just sticking out of my chest for a second there.
I know there are other red dots that are on the map are probably just like other missions and whatnot, and maybe even collectibles that I could be missing out on, but I have no clue how this game works and what to even be looking for, and your boy is not trying to get lost. What the fuck? I don't think they can get close enough to really do anything, and even then, I'm about to laser like half of them. 9S, go in. They got freaking night armor and everything. Like, yo. I feel like these robots that we're fighting are a bit more advanced than we want to realize. Because this right here is insane. Oh, God. There's a big bunch of this way. For the Forest King, Don't yeah, yeah. They're saying to be. Ninus, you're a weird one, you know that? God's sake, ow. Ah! No, you're not headbutting me! Bring it on, buddy! You're literally the last one. And 9S is legitimately kicking your ass, dude. Laser beam! I'm not gonna let you take all the credit, 9S. I'm sorry. Broken key. Where the heck are we even supposed to be going? Okay, that way. Whoa, that's a body. Whoa, okay. That one did not do too well. Goat Slayer 1122. A ferocious soldier saw a machine cover the sky. Saw a machine cover the sky at a closed theater. Huh. Uh, what you got for me? Uh, money, critical up, drop rate, and counter. Heck yeah. Give me all of the chips, baby. Alright, so, going this way. This forest is huge. Okay, those red dots are probably save points. Okay, the red dots are save points, if How I remember are we correctly. Supposed to Whoa. Reach that castle? Well, what we do is we need to get on that bridge that's all the way over there. Simple, 9S. Very, very simple. You go this way, and then you go this way, and... Yo, let's go! There's nothing but bits of metal. That dude was scary. Where did y'all get the armor plating for this? I hear the calls of his friends on dry sand. All right, retrieve. What are you gonna give me? Uh, money, shockwave plus three, weapon attack up plus four. Hold up. We got some goodies. Okay, from here we should be able to at least find the bridge that we need to cross. Okay, yeah, we have access to it now. Across the river. Whoa, okay. Is the bridge down here? Yeah, alright. Okay, we found our way. As long as this thing doesn't decide to crumble underneath our feet, we're fine. Okay, we're safe. So those machines had a king? But how can a concept like loyalty be understood by a machine? 
Heck if I know. I mean, they seem to do it pretty fine out here. So we're about to go meet this king and see what this king got is all about, bro. That doesn't seem too good. What the heck? Oh my- Oh god! Okay, that's a big boy. Focus on the smaller ones. Because they're going to cause the biggest trouble. Oh god, 9S. Ah god, the shockwave goes forever! Holy shit. Hit, dude. Ow! Ah! God! Okay, I can't even touch it? Is that what you told me? Ah! Frick! Take a laser beam! Right in your kneecaps. Right in your kneecaps. Right in your kneecaps. I'm gonna bite your knees. <laughs> oh god, what the actual? Alright, he's almost dead though. I'm gonna bite your knees. And down he falls. Alright, so that was, I'm guessing, their guardian to this giant castle. So we're gonna continue to make our way forward. We need to find a save point, I'll say that much. When androids developed the technology needed for them to actually double jump properly. Speaking of save points! I love the music. I have a feeling that we're gonna encounter a boss in that area. Part of me ain't ready for it. Part of me ain't ready for it. Alright, we're gonna quick save. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and pause here, because I have no clue how long this next section is gonna take, and I don't want to go over the time limit that I have. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. If you liked the video, make sure that you subscribe, turn on notification bell, hit that like button, and share it to everyone that you possibly can. And now is the time you need to be joining the Discord so you can stay up to date with my moving progress, when I'm going to be uploading, and everything else in between. Again, thank you guys so much for watching today, and I will see you guys in the next one.